Hello guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Call of Duty Black Ops 4 for the PC. Um, so it looks like gun game is back. And in this game mode, players start off with the weakest gun and they work their way up, eliminating players and getting another gun once they have that elimination. So this is a, this is a favorite for a lot of people. Um, out of all the modes, I'd say this is probably the one that takes the most skill. Um, because there's no specialist abilities, there's nothing, it's just you and the gun, and everyone starts pretty even. So, uh, what's, what's different about this mode in Black Ops 4 is that uh, it seems like everyone has uh, the UAV up, so you don't have someone just camping out. Um, that's definitely a, a change. Um, so the first gun you start off with was the Mosul, uh, so I, I got that done real quick, and here I'm, I'm, I have the Strife. Uh, it's the second pistol that you that you get. Um, the next gun here is a shotgun, the Moz, the Mog 17, sorry. Um, and it's the only shotgun you get to use. And after that, you you go straight into the SMG, uh, which is the MX MX9 SMG. And then after that, you get to the uh, Cordite SMG. So all in all, there's about 20 weapons or 20 kills that you got to go through uh, to complete the game. There's about eight players playing one time so um, yeah it's pretty fun and it, it's free for all it's the best kind of free for all there is uh, and it's super balanced um, no one no one has a has a big advantage over the other or a disadvantage over the other uh, that's why I like this game mode so much um, and in the beginning it, it's it's really really easy to, to get some kills especially with the SMGs uh, but when you start getting into the later the late game when you start getting you know the sniper rifles and eventually the Helian Salvo rocket launcher. It's it gets tough, especially since that rocket launcher can't kill anyone in one hit unless you get a direct hit. Um, and the reload times are, are, are crazy slow, um, so you really gotta time it properly. You got that kill there. Uh, and I think the strategy with this game is just to to, to really use the UAV and, and take take your time. You know, don't just run and gun. Uh, because it is free for all, so there's enemies going to be coming out left and right from any, every corner. So um, just take your time, use the UAV. Everyone has it, so you can't necessarily hide. So it's good, it's good to keep moving, um, but definitely use it to your advantage. So here we have the Swordfish, which is the the burst uh, assault rifle or burst tactical rifle, and uh, at close range, it's it's terrible. And as you work your way up the the gun list, uh, you start getting weapons that are harder and harder to use, stronger but harder to use. Also late in the game, I started experiencing lag spikes, which is pretty annoying. But uh, it wasn't it wasn't too bad. Um, it wasn't the smoothest game I've ever had, but uh, yeah, it was definitely annoying. And we had that one guy at first for a long time. Um, so I was I was rushing trying to trying to get him trying to catch up to that guy. Down. Also, um, if you melee somebody, that basically sets them back, brings them back one uh, one gun. It's good if you uh, if someone's in the lead and you you melee that guy, then he essentially uh, loses his spot or loses a spot. And you know once you get to the higher levels, you know, they they they're starting to have weapons that are worse and worse for, for closer range. Other than the LMGs, these LMGs are, are, are deadly. But yeah, you, it, it gets easier to, to, to melee uh, someone with a sniper rifle. It gets easier to melee someone with a rocket. So you gotta be careful not to, uh, not to get uh, too confident. So here we are, the Koshka. And I was lucky enough to get that guy right away. But in this one, yeah, I totally missed. I'm not the best sniper around. I usually don't pick any sniper rifles when I'm playing multiplayer. Um, but when I do use them, it's really satisfying to use. But I find them extremely hard to use. That's why I don't use them. You gotta, you gotta have a lot of patience. And there's a lot of stuff like that. I'm pretty sure that guy right there was really pissed. So here, I was trying to look for the guy on, on the UAV. He looked like he, he was upstairs. And I totally missed that shot there, and we got that lag there. And I was lucky enough for him to come to me and not kill me right away. And oh my god, we got that lag again. So now I'm on my last, my last gun or my last weapon. And it's the combat knife. And you know, I pull away from from the first guy, and eventually gets. I missed the first time, 
And he wasn't able to kill me because he had a sniper rifle, it seemed. But uh, yeah, that's that's the gun game. I'm glad they, they brought it back. Um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people are going to be playing playing this game mode a lot. It's fun. It's it's simple. Uh, you know, no perks, no no crazy guns, no crazy specialists. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Take it easy, guys.